Wow. Let's drop the shit out of that. Oh, that is a, it's a bloody good one for the camera. Oh yeah, what do you know, you tow it. So up flushes, we got 322 to the hole. Nice little par four. Let's go see if we can make a bird. Wow, just dropped the shit out of that. Turns out my stripe show wasn't as much of a stripe show as what I thought it was. So we got 75 to the flag here, but obviously a lot of tree trouble. So I'm going to try to avoid this rough because it's super thick. And if I hit it into that rough, it's just gonna stop dead on where it is. So I'm gonna shift my target right hand side of the green. And basically all I'm looking at here is just to try to get this ball on the green somewhere, even if it's just short right. That quite nicely. Go, go. Okay, just short, totally happy with that. I'm just gonna place it because otherwise I'd probably thin it and hit it into the fringe and it'll be no good. And we're on YouTube, so I'm gonna make it look good. It's gonna be uphill right to left. A chance to hold this. I flubbed it a little bit. And that's why it's short. I left myself about a five footer for part. So go uphill, right to left. It's about four or five feet. Yeah, nice, real good. That's a bogey. Oh, shit. So nice little bogey to start us off. Didn't even really hit a bad shot there, but oh well. 356, par four, dog leg left to right. Downwind, let's take it to Pound Town. This little drop kick just down the left hand side. Should have just caught up in the rough there. Won't be too hard of a shot from there. So we just got caught up in this left rough here. Super thick as you could see. 69 meters. Just gonna try to land this into the upslope on the fringe there and just let it trickle on. Let's try and make a birdie. Just come out dumpy. Absolutely no spin on it. Lands on the upslope. Pretty average bounce out to the right there. Pin high right, say 20-ish feet. Not too bad. We've got about 20 feet left up the hill. I really have no idea what the break is doing on this one, but I'm gonna play it just outside right. Hopefully falls in for a nice little bird. Let's get us back to even par. It's looking good, no, just short. All right, easy par, on to the next. 350 par four, dog leg right to left, and I absolutely refuse to play the dog leg because I cannot draw it, and the wind's over my shoulder. So we're gonna hit a big old slice into the fairway. Oh yeah, what do you know, you tow it. It's too far left, in the trees. Let's just try not make a bogey. 124, we're an option of going high or low. Um, not liking this high option just because I can't fade it enough. Even though the lie is pretty good, trying to fade it out of the rough is a big struggle. So we're gonna try and hit a low one. And again, we're gonna try to cover this rough just because it's so thick out here. And my main priority is trying to get it underneath those tree limbs. And then the second priority is trying to get it over that rough just so that it doesn't get caught up in it. It's gonna be a tricky one to control just because of the distance between the rough and the in the start of the green. So we're gonna try just land it in the fairway, run up the slope of the green. And again, we're just trying to make a par. If I can make a birdie and shoot even par well, you'd be lucky. Oh, I've hit that. Very nice. Oh, I'm reckon birdie time. That's actually phenomenal. And it's just ran over to the back fringe, but I mean, that's really good from there. This is all I've got left for my bird. Hell of a shot from in those trees. Drop a comment down, what are the chances I make this? I'm thinking pretty high. It really needs to drop. I'm not shooting over par again. Downhill, right to left, I think. Oh. I was about to say shame haters, but I guess shame Ethan. Let's just tidy this one up. Please remember to take your time on these short putts. They do require a bit of attention. 
Okay, one over. We're going to a bonus hole because I need to make a birdie on camera. You guys are in for a treat here. I'll probably pick the hardest hole to make a birdie on, but I'm gonna give it a go. So the flag is pretty much the right edge of these toy toys. You can't see it, but I'll throw a little target out there for you to see kind of where I'm aiming at. Wind's over my shoulder, so off the left, and it looks just a touch into. So we've got 153 number, six down, 146, no, 147, let's go with that, is the number. Got a nice little eight here. Pretty well, just depends on that distance. It's looking good. Oh, that is a golf shot. Now we're talking, baby. You're gonna love where that finished. So just to build your guys' trust, I'm about to repair the pitch mark. Just so you know, I'm not taking the piss out of you guys. What do we got? About 10 feet. It's our best chance today. 10 feet, definitely going right to left, slightly up the hill. It's all about just trying to figure out how much this is gonna break. But I'm really liking that line. All right, let's do it for the boys. Oh, well, tap and par. Maybe next time I'll make a birdie for you guys. That's the bonus hole, and it's the three hole stroke play.